What's up scale modelers and siren enthusiasts welcome back to another video to us today. Today I'd like to do a unboxing and reaction video to the Ralford Clifford Models 3T22 Siren Kit in HO scale or 1 over 87th scale. Basically I'm going to open up the kit and inspect the parts and see what I think of it and tell you guys my thoughts as I go along inspecting the parts. Uh, this isn't my typical review. I have no experience building this type of uh, this siren kit at all, or a siren even similar to this, because I'm used to building the uh, rotational Thunderbolt siren kits. So this will be interesting. Let's start. So as you can tell, it comes in the standard uh, model siren kit plastic baggie. Uh, of course, the instructions are very simple but very cool. I like how they're in color. Um, here's what they look like. Um, looks cool. I've been actually intending to order this one for a while, but I never really could wrap my head around how I'd mount it. Uh, here it is. Uh, here's like the instructions and stuff. Again, same as the SD10 kit that I reviewed earlier. Very nice, uh, very nice 3D modeling here on how to assemble it. Looks like a very straightforward assembly process. Shouldn't be too hard for me at least. Um, yeah, let's uh, inspect the parts. So you got your wood pole here and <laughs> this beehive looking thing. The siren really does look like a beehive, so that's pretty cool. Alright, so that's all the parts. So here's all the parts. Uh, the standard wooden utility pole seen in the siren kits from Ralph, Ralph and Clifford models. Appears to be smaller in diameter than, than what they used to be, but shouldn't be too crazy since I intend to roof mount this one. Um, here's the motor. By the way, I did open this one already, so I kind of was toying around with it. Um, so what I'm holding in my hand is the 12 ports uh, side of the 3T22. Basically, this refers to the amount of holes in the stator, which is the thing that surrounds the blades or the chopper that spin and make the noise. There's 12 of those holes here, and there's 12 corresponding horns. So this is the 12 port side. Uh, looks really cool, actually. Very, a lot more detailed than I thought it would be. Looks uh, high quality. This is the motor, it's just a standard cylindrical shape. I might uh, add a little junction box, box to it so I can put conduit on it when I um, set it up on a pole or the roof mount that I intend on doing. Uh, the support structure looks like it's a nightmare of flash, but flash is really easy to deal with and it looks like it's still, uh, the whole thing is intact and there's no issues so I won't complain, I'll just have to spend a few minutes removing the flash. Uh, should be a decent fit. Here's the bottom, uh, the bottom portion of horns, or the um, ten port side. Uh, the 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 top. This section goes on the top. The twelve port side goes on the top. The ten port side goes on the bottom. Also looks really nice. The horns seem to have gaps in between them, so I'm gonna have to. You can see there's a lot of flash in between those, so I'm gonna um, stick my hobby knife in there and clear that out. Uh, but also looks nice. I like the little um, indentations here in the horns as well. Here's the top section with the top intake and the cover. Not the cover, but like the little shroud protecting it. There's even a little uh, little eye bolt here, which looks really nice. Uh, very good overall. And of course, your standard control box for uh, that's included in most, or I think all, Ralph Cliffa siren kits. And as short as that video was, that basically concludes the unboxing and reaction to this. This kit honestly looks like it's going to be really simple to build, but it's going to be fun. Uh, I'm going to have a lot of fun definitely trying to figure out how to make a mounting truss for this to put it on my building that I intend on mounting it on. Uh, and we'll see where this crazy journey takes us. That's basically all I have to say. If you have any questions about the kit or anything I said in this video, feel free to drop that down below in the comments. Like, comment, and subscribe. Stay tuned for more Siren content. And feel free to watch some of my model airplane videos as well. And I'll see you guys later.